How's it gaming guys? I'm Phil in the Blanks and thanks so much for tuning into this question of the day compilation. Like always, there are 25 questions in the video. Go down to the comments and answer all 25 questions as truthfully as you can. You can be silly, you can be serious, I don't really care. But anyone who answers all 25 questions within the first week of this video being uploaded to YouTube will be in a random draw to choose a game from a big 300 game list of games for me to play for them on the channel. So what are you waiting for? Watch the video, answer those questions. I, I don't think they've improved the Joy-Cons, and there's a lot of problems with the Joy-Cons. Question of the day, if you have a Switch, have you had problems with Joy-Cons? Yeah, question of the day, uh, what's your favorite Star Fox game? Mine would probably have to be, I know this sounds weird, but it, I think mine's D, uh, the DS one, Command. Um, and it doesn't help that there's not a lot of Star Fox games, there's like seven. Oh, and there's also Star Fox 2, I completely forgot about that. So question of the day, I think it's a pretty obvious question, what's your guys' favorite turtle character? Well, actually two questions of the day then. Who's your favorite turtle? And you can pick from all six turtles. And that's, yes, there are six turtles. There's Michelangelo, uh, Raphael, Leonardo Donatello, there's Venus from the terrible live action show. And I guess there's a new character. I don't know her name though. Uh, but there's a new uh, turtle that's being added to the new turtle show. And uh, I, people are, I guess, liking her. I don't know if the show's out yet, with her yet, but whatever. Also, second part of that question of the day, I, I mentioned the turtles, but question of the day, what's your favorite turtles character in general? Like, not a turtle. I mean, it could be a turtle if that's your favorite character, but if you have a different favorite character, tell me. It's like with um, DuckTales. My favorite DuckTales character is not, like, part of the main cast. It's, like, it's uh, Gizmo Duck and Fenton Crackshell. Love them. This is most people's favorite uh, Donkey Kong Country. I would not say it's my favorite. Um, it's definitely up there. It's my second favorite. My absolute favorite is Donkey Kong Country 3. And that's a... Um, that's a fairly unique opinion. Not a lot of people have that opinion. Um, question of the day. What's your guys' Actually, whoops, I remember Diddy. Uh, what's your guys' favorite Donkey Kong Country game? Like I said, mine is uh, definitely number three. I just find number three has something brand spanking new in every single level, and I love it. It makes it just so unique and fun to play. Get you around. Got these crocodiles here. I'm assuming the crocodiles? I don't know. They could be alligators. I can never tell. Can you? Can you tell the difference? Question of the day, can you tell the difference between a crocodile and an alligator? And I don't mean like, can you look it up and tell me? No, I mean like, would you be able to? Just like offhand, without looking anything up, would you be able to know? Wing. Definitely fun. Question of the day, what is your favorite kind of level in Donkey Kong Country 2? We've only seen a few. We've only seen, uh, we've seen pirate ship. We've seen the rigging levels. We've seen the uh, underwater pirate ship. Uh, that's pretty much it. And then now we've seen Volcano, we've seen Crystal Mines. There are a lot more. We get into some crazy ones in the next few worlds. Not specifically the next one. The next one's very swampy. But after that, man, all bets are off. It gets it gets crazy. Mm, all that honey. All that honey in the background. Um, I'm not a big honey guy. I don't dislike it or anything. It's, it's not my thing. I've never really tried marmalade. I don't know why, it just sounds like it's gross. What about you guys? What's the kind of thing that you like for like stuff? I don't know, do you like honey? Do you like other such things? I don't know. It's kind of a random question. It doesn't even really have a. It's not really a. <laughs> it's a very vague question. Do you like honey or other things? No, I don't like things, Phil. I don't know. It's, to me, it's a breakfast thing, I guess. I don't know if anyone else counts it as that, but that's what I've always thought of it as. Why is. Alright. Yeah, to me it's always been like a breakfast thing, like something you put, something like on toast or, or something. I guess you could put in tea and all that stuff. I just don't use honey, so I don't really think of it. Rest of the day, what kind of things do you like as like spreads for like honey, or not for honey, like for breakfast? I'm a big uh, raspberry jam guy. I like it when the jam, like raspberry jam, I like it when the seeds are there. Mmm, so good. It's just like, oh, it's seedless raspberry jam. Like, that's not good enough. Away with you. I think I'm so funny. <laughs> Apologies if you don't think that I'm funny, but I mean, you're the you're the fool who tuned in, not me. <laughs> Who's the fool? The fool who makes foolish videos or the fool who watches the fool making foolish videos? Question of the day. <laughs> Who's the fool? I think it's either the balloon or the coil. I always forget. Or not the coil, though. Whatever it's called. Bionic Commando Arm. The Wire, that's what it's called. Question of the day. Have you ever, have you ever watched The Wire? 
the TV show. I've actually never watched it. Heard it's good. I have no idea what it's about. I did at one point. I did work at Blockbuster back when that was open. It was fairly popular back then. We had uh, episodes of it to, to rent. Question of the day. Oh, jeez. One second. Careful. Oh, he can't get me from over here. Question of the day. Has anyone... Um, have you guys watched the... I think it's the... Ruby Spears? I think that's the company name. The Ruby Spears Mega Man cartoon show. From the... I think the mid to late 90s. I like it. I liked it. It's cheesy. Very cheesy. But I liked it. Uh, Ian James Corlett, who voices... Um, like Cheetor and Beast Wars and that sort of thing. Um, and I think he was also the first version of Goku. Um, in, uh, of Goku in, in the English Dragon Ball Z. Uh, he did the voice of Mega Man and he did a really good job. And the guy who voices uh, Rat Trap and a bunch of other guys from Beast Wars, whose name I can't picture now, which is a shame because he's like a really, really good voice actor, uh, voices Proto Man. I think he also voices Dr. Wily in uh, Captain N. But anyways, it was a good show. So. I'm wondering, did you guys watch it? Did you like it? If you did, what did you like about it? I actually like the designs of the characters. I know it's weird because Mega Man's this kind of strangely buff guy. Uh, and roles, like, much more mature. Like, they're not kids, basically. But I liked their designs. I liked the Robot Master designs, too. They looked really cool. Don't know why Cup Man sounded like Igor, but it weirdly enough fit him? I don't know. Question of the day. What is your favorite Wily Castle? I think I've asked that before when I did, um, I did the, um, NES games, but now that we've seen some, uh, really cool space stations, what's your favorite? I don't know, I'd have to see them all, like, together to kind of really pick. Some really cool ones, though. Give me something, please. No, not cake. Mmm, cake. I do like cake. Question of the day. What cake do you like? I like... Reg I like real cake. Uh, my wife is super into the um, ice cream cake that, like, you yeah, get at Dairy Queen stuff. Oh, no! That like, surprised the crap out of me. I'm surprised I, I reacted to that fast enough, to be honest. Um, I don't dislike the that cake. I just don't like it nearly as much as cake. You know, real cake that you bake and stuff. Um, I like Black Forest cake. Or was that what it's called? Black? I don't know. So, question of the day. What's your favorite planet? You know... Mine's always been Jupiter. I like electricity and thunder and that kind of stuff. That's always been like the, the lightning kind of planet. Plus, I like how big it is. It's got the, the cool um, storm. Like, it's just, I don't know. There's a lot I like about Jupiter. It's just really cool. It's always been my favorite planet because of that stuff. Ugh. But you, what about you? Question of the day. What's your stance on the whole Pluto thing? My opinion is it's not a planet. And if it is, then we have to, you know admit that a bunch of other things are also planets because there are a bunch of other heavenly bodies that are bigger than Pluto that are also going around the sun so if you count Pluto then you, we have more we either have eight planets or we have more than nine let's just say question of the day when you were a kid what did you call one-ups I called the one-ups um, though there were times when I called them uh, free free men I think my, my like parents called them free guys so question of the day what do you guys like about Christmas so about Christmas a little bit. Not specifically the... I mean, if, if the religious part of it is what you like, I beheld Satan as lightning fall from the earth. Wouldn't be Goliath or Stephen, whoever that is. Um, I'm just going to skip this stuff. If, uh, if the religious aspect of Christmas is what you enjoy about it, please tell me. But it doesn't have to be. This isn't about that. It's uh, like, you know, what do you like about it? I love, like, the traditional Christmassy stuff. I'm a big fan of, like, the 50s-style Christmas music. You know what I mean? Like... I really like that stuff. Big Crosby and even Elvis and whatnot just makes me happy. Uh, one of one of my favorite Christmas stuff is actually, actually Alvin and the Chipmunks. I know that's super dorky, but I listened to them when I was a kid for Christmas, so it makes me, you know, in the Christmas mood. So, like, tell me about you guys. What do you like about Christmas? What puts you in the Christmas mood? What do you guys like about wings? Do you like wings? Do you have a good wing place around your place? I live in Moncton, New Brunswick, and there's not a lot of good wing places here. People tell me there are, but there's not. I got some good wings from Toronto, and that's where good wings are from. At least for me. But whatever. I like spicy wings, I like other wings. One of the things I really like is, um... Uh, I call it, um... Well, I don't call it this. The place I went to calls it, uh, Hot Dealio. It's hot sauce with, like, a dill sauce. Oh, it's so good. It's so good. I like pickles. So anything with pickles makes me happy. It's a question of the day. What's your favorite season? You a winter guy or a summer guy? Or, you know, in between. 
I definitely like the summer and the spring a lot more than the fall and the, the winter. To be honest, I don't have anything against win uh, fall. I just, I don't like that it comes right before winter. So, you hear now. Of course, the day. I know I said, like, um, like, favorite season because of the ice and fire area, but, like, what's your favorite type of level in a video game? I love the sky stuff. Like, lots of this bullshit, huh? No problem. Bullshit's my middle name. It's actually Michael. Question of the day, what's your middle name? <laughs> it's a very random one. Jeez, that scared the shit out of me. Question of the day, who's your favorite video game ninja? Um, I don't know. I'm not a, I, I don't actually play a lot of ninja games, despite what I've been saying. Um, the ninja, the old school Ninja Gaiden games are definitely good. But I don't really like Ryo Hayabusa that much. I mean, he doesn't really know all that much. His lines are all pretty much just, what the? <laughs> I mean the old school Ninja Gaiden games. I only played the first um, of the newer Ninja Gaiden games. I say newer, but it came out like 2002 or something. I do like Scorpion Sub-Zero. I think everyone likes Scorpion Sub-Zero. Kind of a cute idea. Question of the day. What kind of spaceship shooters do you like? I guess I could just call them shoot 'em ups which is really what they are. I don't know why I call them spaceship shooters. But um, I personally like the ones... Um, that are the vertical ones. Like, this is a horizontal one, but I like the vertical ones better. Not that it really matters, but I don't know. I just like those ones for some reason. I like bullet hell games. But yeah, question of the day. Have you played The Messenger? And if you haven't, are you going to play it now that you've seen this? Look at the bunches. Honey bunches of oats. Mm. Question of the day. What's your favorite cereal? <laughs> I have the dumbest questions of the day. Dark Fool Dave, you're the one who gave the idea for the question of the day, and it's it's gone nowhere for me. <laughs> it's the dumbest thing. I hope you're proud. <laughs> uh, yeah, favorite cereal. Man, I don't know. Have you tried Chocolate Crave? Damn, that's good. I had a free sample once, and I was like, this stuff is freaking awesome. I love it. I also like Reese's Peanut Butter Puffs. But in terms of something that's better for someone my age, um, I love um, Oatmeal Crisp. There we go, 25 questions. Hopefully down there you have 25 answers for the random draw. With that, thanks again for watching. I'm Phil Blanks. See you next level.